Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be doing some spot and stock bow hunting on some big mouflon. So before we start off our hunt today, I kind of want to show you what our plan is. We have a couple of really good resting zones out here for mouflon. We have one right here from 9 o'clock until 15. We have another one right here from 9 until 15. And then we have a really good bedding spot for some Iberian wolf from 7 o'clock until 11. We're going to try and get on them as well. Now you might be wondering how I actually did find this spot. Well, the truth is I was up here on this ridge and I looked way off over the distance and I saw something that looked like it was a diamond potential mouflon. Now I looked three, four times and I couldn't quite spot it because it was about 450 yards. Render distance typically is around 450, 460. So they could easily pop in and out of render distance, but it was somewhere around right here. And what happened was I actually decided to slide on over to the right side. Then I decided to get a little bit closer. So I went over to that point right there and I looked down and I actually saw a couple of mouflon bedded right there. I did spot them and I got a location, but I don't know exactly if the big one's going to be there, but that's his location right there. 930 until 1530. So we're going to work our way over there and see if we can get this nice ram. All right, there we go. We just snuck up to about 90 yards out from this first herd of mouflon. Now I don't see the big one yet, but he's got to be over there somewhere. So we're just going to try and spot out this area and see if we can't find him so we know exactly where he is. We can get a little bit better of an idea on what we're dealing with. You know, that could be him, right? Yes, it is. That's him right there, bedded about 90 yards out. So at least now we know where he's at. He's kind of on the backside of the hill, but I think we're going to go prone now and try and get a little bit closer. Well, guys, I wasn't planning on this, but I just spotted a couple of rams right next to us here. We have one bedded less than 20 yards away. A pretty nice solid four right there. Now, I don't exactly like this angle. I mean, we could probably try for a spinal cord, maybe intestine, liver. But what I want to do is slide over a little bit more, try and get perfectly broadside, and then maybe take a bedded shot. I don't know. If we can slide over and get a perfect broadside shot, we just might go for it. Okay, so I actually see a couple of rams off in the shrubs here over here to the right side of us, but we gotta be careful we don't spook them. Right there, we got a ram, and looks like a small one there next to him. Probably a female, and another one there. But this is our big ram here. We're about 15 yards away. We're sliding over, trying to get more broadside on him, but I think this just might work. We got a nice little pocket right here. So if we can get in this position, I think we might have an opportunity right there 15 yards away and i think this is going to be our chance luckily for you we're him for 20 so let's draw back held it right for the heart and he's down perfect shot so we must have missed the heart but we probably didn't miss by much i was holding for kind of a little too far forward if we would have missed the heart we were only going to hit lung but i know with a single lung i think you still do get 100 percent quick kill so yeah all right, well, here he is down here. I don't want to spook the other ram, but let's pick him up. Got a right lung at 16 yards away, 858. You can see we just hit a little too far forward of the heart. Still smoked him, and that's a really solid ram at 16 yards away. Okay, so we're creeping around the next corner here, and I heard a ram somewhere nearby. I don't see him just yet, but he's got to be here close. If we get a little bit closer, we're going to go prone. Well, I'm pretty sure that's the big one that I saw. He looks like he's a five, but he's only a four, but he's still a huge four. We're zeroed in for 20. So when he walks, we're going to draw back and see if we can't make a perfect shot. All right, here we go. And smoked him right off of the rock. I think we ended up getting a heart shot. That's a really nice ram. Should be close to a 900 ram. That's the one that I saw way up on the ridge there at about 450 yards out. Now, I tried to spot this thing like four or five times. I still could not get a spotting on him until just now. But I can guarantee you that was probably the one that I saw. Because these other ones don't look anywhere near the same size as him. Well, here he is down here. He has some really awesome horns on him, some really good curls, and he's probably gonna score pretty decent. We'll find out in a second. I thought I saw something. And we did get a double lung heart shot at 33 yards out. He's gonna score 883. Man, close to a 900 plus Ram. But here's the thing, anything that's gonna score over 880, they start to look like they're gonna be 900 plus. And when they're 900 plus, they could potentially be a diamond, especially at long distance. Well, I mean, not that they're gonna score a diamond, but they look like they could potentially be 
a diamond. So that's a massive ram. I'm really happy with him. Double lunk hard shot at 33 yards out, but wow. Okay, so I think we're gonna head over to the next rest zone now and hope that we can find some decent rams over there. In fact, I think that's them right there. It looks like we have a couple of smaller rams on the front here. Got a three right there and probably another three. I don't see anything giant, but there should be a pretty good one down there somewhere. Well, we got another pretty good three right there, but if you look right behind, that is definitely the horn of a four. A really solid ram right behind him. I can't quite spot him just yet, but 170 out, but at least we know there's a good one in this herd. Okay guys, so I don't know if this is a different herd or what, but I can see a couple coming in on the right side here and what is that, what is that? Well, I think that might be our big four. Let's try and draw back and see if we can't take a shot because he's getting way too close. Oh man, I don't know if he ducked it or what, but the arrow just went right over the top of him. Well, can't get them all, I guess. Well, that didn't exactly go as I planned. That ram got way too close, way too fast, and he ended up ducking our shot. But we're gonna try and get a little bit closer this time, and I think we might be in a pretty good position here if that ram comes back. I feel like he went over this hill here. I just gotta wait till he comes back. Okay, I see some motion there. That's a three, and another three. Where's the four? Uh, I think that's him. Okay, let's get ready. Let's get ready. I'm pretty sure. Got a three coming out in the front here. Hopefully. Oh, right there, right there. The second one. Let's get on him. And smoked. Dropped him right there. Nice four down. So that should be the four that we saw from before. Actually, I don't know if it's the same herd or not. But all I know is that's a decent four. A real decent one. And looks like we have another pretty good one right there running away. That should be another four as well. Yes, it is. And there's another one in the front right there. I think that's another four right there. So it looks like there's two more fours in this herd. But what I want to do is slide forward maybe five yards closer. That way we can actually see them as they're coming in. Because that ram came way too close, way too fast. And luckily, we were in position to get the shot off. But this time, I try and want to get a little bit closer here. So we can actually see him as he comes. Oh, here comes one. I think... Uh, I don't think that's the four. He just stopped right behind that brush. Come on. Where'd he go? Oh, it looks like there's a couple coming in. Okay, here he comes. Here he comes. See, this is what I mean by sliding forward because now we can at least see this guy's coming right on top of us. I think we're going to go for a shot on this three just because he's so close. And we did drop him. I don't think we hit the heart, but that's our four right there. He was about to come over the ridge, but he, oh, well, I guess he got spooked. All right, guys, I think this is him. This should be our four. He's about 20 out. Let's see if we can't take him. Oh. And we did drop him, but right when I was about ready to squeeze the trigger, we had a leaf blocking the entire site, and I, I kind of just wanted to let one fly, but that wouldn't be very ethical. We had to be able to at least see our site. And if we can't see it, we're not going to take the shot. So it looks like we have three there. And I don't see the other four. So I believe we took down both fours. Although I do hear another one over here. But we're just going to slide over here and pick up the first one. I think this is the first one that we got. But yeah, three of them laying right here. Pretty nice one right there. 823. Got a double lung liver at 12 yards out. That was the one that we had to take a quick trotting shot. Nice solid gold there. And 998 cash. And we'll grab this one. I think this is a three, so it's probably not going to be that big, but we'll pick it up anyways. And that's actually a gold. 801 gold. We got a liver, left lung, stomach at nine yards away. Very nice. And we'll grab this one right here. Okay, so I see another three there, but I'm not really worried about that. Let's grab this one. This is, ah, uh, this was a three, so we actually didn't get the four. Got a double lung at 13 yards away, but do you guys see this? We just got a thousand cash, a thousand plus cash for both those threes. And we only got 998 cash for uh, that big four. All right. I think we're going to try and find some Iberian Wolf. We just got us on our first one out here at about 120 yards out. Now it's a resting zone. So there should be probably like four or five wolves here. So we're going to try and sneak over, get within about 50 and try and pick out the biggest one. It's easier said than done, but we'll see what happens. Well, we just snuck up to about 50 yards away from the pack and we're already getting growled at and that's what I meant by saying It's easier said than done because we're about to get attacked by a whole pack of wolves But if you think that's cool, 
You should see what's gonna happen next. Hey, we'll take a heart shot on that first wolf. I believe we got it because he dropped right in his tracks. We got a couple more coming in here. I want to try and find the big one, but I think we'll go for this one first. Try for a heart. Definitely smoked him, but somehow we just missed it. We'll see if we can't take another one and actually missed. But we got to get out of here and try and get a little more safe. All right. Now, I'm trying to figure out... Uh-oh. I'm trying to figure out which one. I think that one right... No, maybe? Yeah, I think that one right there is the big one. Okay, so we just smoked that one. That should have been the biggest one. You know, sometimes I get so confused by this because I feel like every time I take the biggest one down, another one comes in and attacks us, and the whole pack should be leaving, but they just keep, keep coming. So maybe... We'll see if we can't take one more. I think that's got to be... Oh, and are you kidding me? The time it matters most, and I met... Oh, here we go. Oh, that was like a two-yard shot. Guaranteed double lung, and I think that was actually the biggest one. And that shouldn't make them leave. Well, after all that, they finally left. So I think that might have been the biggest one. I don't know. Um, yep, that was a... <laughs> two yards away, double lung. 2.0 yards away from a gray, uh, a gray Iberian wolf. And we should probably save him, but you know what? Had he been a mythical, we probably would, but I'm not trying to blow all the cash that we just made. We just made a bunch of money the other day, and it's so good to be able to actually have money where if you need it, you have it. Got a double lung liver on this one. There was actually a female at eight yards away, but we'll get the 1,200 cash. And wolves, I thought you were done, right? Didn't you learn your lesson? I uh, got a right lug on this one. That was a small male, five medium. Just missed the heart. Still got 100%. And another one down right here. Now, I think this is a female as well. Uh, no, that was another male. Five medium, left lung liver. And I think that was like the second one that came at us. But uh, I think that might be a pretty good way to end this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. Oh my God. Come on, give me a shot. Give me a shot. Oh, just missed him. Hold on, we got another one coming. I think that was a solid hit. But he's still running. Anyways, with that, that's going to be it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.